hair tutorial. This is a very easy thing to do. It does take a tiny little bit of practice, but um, if you can French braid, you can do this look easily. And um, you can really do this with anything. You can make it look casual, you can make it look elegant, you can wear it for prom, you can wear it for a wedding or for just any day. I wear it to work sometimes when I don't want my hair in my face and I just love it. Or like in the summer when you don't want your hair like sticking to your neck. Um, yeah, so let's get started. So first things first, I'm just gonna brush my hair just so there's no like tangles in it. So I am really terrible at trying to explain how to do a French braid. And so um, I am like 100% positive there are like 10 million videos here on YouTube on how to French braid. So just type in like, how do I French braid if you don't know how to. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna get into it. So I just took this chunk of hair. We're gonna split that into three. And with this, you're gonna, as you're going down, you also wanna start pulling it to the side a little bit more, if that makes any sense. Um. And as you can tell, it's starting to go kind of down. So while you're braiding, you just want to be pulling it down and to the opposite side. And then right about here, I switch hands after I grab this guy. gonna continue braiding that down. Okay, and then when you can't go anymore, I am taking these little elasticy bands. Just securing that at the end. Okay, so now you can either just leave it like this, kind of like an Elsa braid. Um, you can pull it apart a little bit to make it looser, or you can keep doing what I'm about to do and turn this part into a bun. First pull it apart a little bit. Pull it, pull it. I kind of take the braid, am I even in the thing? I take the braid and I twist it like this, just so it's a little tighter, and then you just kind of Make a little bun out of it. And... Pin the shit out of it. And then, of course, you want to spray the crap out of it with hairspray. But that would be it. You can also... It depends on how you like it. I like it kind of more towards the center. You can do it more off to the side. Or even leave it down like I showed before. But I like it a little more towards the middle. But you can really do what you want. You can make it looser, make the bun bigger by pulling apart the braid a little bit more. When we were pancaking, okay. when we were pancaking it down here, you could just uh, make it a lot looser, and it makes the bun a lot bigger. Or just wrap it looser, and it just make like a messy bun out of it, kind of. Um, but I like this, and then you can pull little hairs out here. Um, the only thing that I find sometimes a little weird about this look. Um, is that it's so tight up here, and then it's like loose right here, but here you can just pull up these parts too and um, Make it just a little looser so it doesn't look, you know, super I don't know, 
tight against your head. But yeah, that is it. There you go. Um, this look you can really wear with anything. Um, I've worn it with dresses or with just t-shirts or with anything really. It works with everything. You can dress it down, you can dress it up, you can do whatever. You can stick little diamondy berets or anything in there. I really do what you want. Like I can move my head and it feels super secure. Which it, I don't know if it's just me. Like let me know in the comments if it's just me. But when I have my hair up in a bun or something that feels really secure, I feel like I could move really quickly because I don't have like so much hair stopping me. Like is it you know how swimmers wear like swimmer caps and that makes them like move quicker because they don't have hair like stopping. I'm freaking weird probably. Oh whatever. Anyways. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you want to do this look, uh, tag me on Instagram or on Twitter. Um, it is this is Jolene on both of them. Follow me on all the social medias, and I will probably follow you back too because I like looking at stuff. And um, yeah, I will see you guys next week. Bye. I mean, it's flat, but it's like. <laughs>